Are you an out-of-state investor? Do you want unbiased due diligence like you've never seen before? That's what we do here. We're going to do it on this property right now. This is your show. This is the show where I work for you directly, taking your needs. I'm going through the MLS, and I'm trying to find the best possible deal for you guys. Put down 25%. That's the perfect way to buy this. That's why real estate investing is the greatest industry in the world. Hey guys, welcome to another episode of the MLS Search and Analysis Show. My name is James Wise. I'm your host. You are watching Holton Wise TV where we give you the good, the bad, the ugly when it comes to real estate. Our whole thing is transparency, guys. You don't believe me? Watch the Tennis from Hell show. I want you guys to see the worst of the worst before you decide to spend your hard-earned money on real estate. And when you guys come on the MLS Search and Analysis Show... We're working together one-on-one -on -one to help you start, build, or grow your real estate portfolios. My clients right now today, company out of Jersey, right, New Jersey, called AHS Consulting. These folks are looking to build a portfolio of rentals here in Cleveland. And you guys were sent uh, a package of properties, four properties, all for sale by owner, and you wanted to get my opinion on them. I just got done filming one of your videos. That's the second one, and I'll be knocking the third and the fourth one out after this one. So this is the property in question that we're talking about, okay? 800 East 157th Cleveland 44111. What? We have here the information. We have an asking price of forty-five thousand, and as far as renovations go, I wrote down fifteen thousand. So you'd need a total investment of sixty thousand. Let me explain that, right? What I have here, the only information I have is what you've given me, right? And then I'm giving you my my knowledge on the market. You have a semi-occupied duplex, okay? Each unit is two one. The one unit is getting six fifty a month in rent, so that's seventy eight hundred dollars a month in rent. This other unit is totally vacant. Now, it very well could be rent ready. I don't know. That is information that you are not able to get from the seller and convey to me. So what I did is I gave you the estimate of 15K. That is a worst case scenario. Well, I mean, well, it's, it's technically it could always be worse, right? But more or less, if you have a unit, a duplex unit in the Cleveland market, and it's all jacked up, right? You had like an eviction, and truth be told, this is a very rough neighborhood. So I would assume the reason this unit is vacant is because they had an eviction, right? Bad tenants are are very prominent in bad neighborhoods, okay? That's that's, that's the way the cookie crumbles, right? So $15,000 more or less is, is like a worst-case scenario of what we can put a unit back together, right? Fifteen k would involve going in, patching a bunch of holes in the walls, having to completely redo the kitchen, having to completely redo the bathroom, have to rip out all carpets, refinish the hardwoods, because a lot of these old Cleveland homes have nice hardwoods. That would cosmetically get you going, right? As far as the mechanicals go, I don't have information on them. These are just, uh, you know, low-income rentals chugging along, so I have no reason to believe you're dealing with brand-new mechanicals, right? So your roofs, just so you guys are aware, roofs on homes like these, they're about $7,000. you got to replace them every 30 years. Furnaces, of course, it's going to come with two of them. They cost about $3,000 to replace. They last 30 years. Hot water tanks, you need two of those. Those cost $1,000 to replace. you got to do that every 15 years, right? So the 15 k budget doesn't have to do with any of that. I'm going to assume all that works. But if the unit's all jacked up, $15,000 is about the cost you would need to put it back together. Of course, you'll want to follow up with that uh, for sale by owner if uh, you want to go any further with the investment. But looking at it, what we have here, it's an all-in investment of about sixty k, and you know I think that's that's tough. That's I wouldn't do the deal at forty five k, not by a long shot. It doesn't make any sense, right? What I like to do in these videos is I give you guys a breakdown uh, of your estimated performance, things like. Property taxes, that's simple, right? The property tax rate in Cleveland is 2.79%, right? You take your purchase price, multiply it by that, boom, you get your taxes, right? But what you run into issues with properties like this, vacancy, non-payment, maintenance, right? Those three things can make or break your investment, and I cannot give you guys a reasonable expectation of performance in a neighborhood like this. This is one of the most blighted neighborhoods in the United States of America. If you notice right here, you see this? 
Don't think that they just, like, were building, like, random big-ass lots on these streets with uh, all these other small lots. It's not special. No, what, it, what that is, there used to be a house there, and then they tore that some bitch down because the neighborhood is so blighted. It didn't make any sense to put them back together, right? So when you're in these rough neighborhoods, you're going to see a lot of that, okay? It's like if you just cruise down the street, right? Here's another one. There used to be a home here. There's no longer a home. You go right here. Look at this. There used to be a home here. That one looks like a recent teardown. It used to be a home here. You get to the corner. Looks like probably two houses got torn down right there. You go over here. Another house got torn down, right? Go down here. Well, let's see. What do you go? Right here. There we go. We're missing a house right there, right? Okay, let's just go just a little bit further. Oh, what do you know? One, two, three, probably four houses right there, all completely torn down. I think you get the picture, right? You're dealing with one of the worst neighborhoods uh, in America. They're just, it, it becomes completely cost prohibitive to fix up these homes, right? Are you a lender? If so, Holton Wise is looking to partner with you. If you're licensed in all 50 states, go to HoltonWise.com. Click the digital media tab to advertise on Holton Wise TV today. If you go to HoltonWise.com, got the ultimate guide to grading Cleveland neighborhoods for you. I pulled it up already, right? I wrote this guide, guys. Comprehensive guide grading all the neighborhoods in the greater Cleveland area. This particular property falls in this area, red. Red means D or F neighborhood. If you scroll down to the bottom, I even give you guys more information on this neighborhood. This is 44110, okay? Median income, $21,000. That's household income, okay? 2.3 people, I think. That's like the average amount of people in a house, right? I'm pretty sure that's two adults and 0.3 kids, right? So half the houses in this neighborhood between two adults can't bring in more than $21,000, right? So you're dealing with super low-income stuff, right? So uh, very, very, very difficult neighborhood to make money, very difficult neighborhood for you to you know, estimate your performance because, look, you guys are out-of-state investors, okay? You guys are from New Jersey. You need licensed property management companies to handle this for you. We're not going to touch this. This is uh, too dangerous. My staff doesn't like being in these neighborhoods. It's, it's just too dangerous. They turn over. It, it's not worth it for us. So you guys do not have the ability to self-manage because you're in New Jersey, and you don't have the ability to hire a reputable company because a lot of the reputable companies out here will, will tell you the same, right? So that leads you to, like, Craigslist handymen, unlicensed folk, right? And they might sound good uh, because they're cheap. But look, they're unlicensed, they're illegal, they're not doing things by the book, and they're only really probably in these tough neighborhoods because they can't get business in, in the other neighborhoods that all the big PM firms want. So that just couples uh, the unpredictability of your investment. So I think it would be a crazy investment uh, at 60 k all in. I pulled the comps for you guys real quick, just so you guys could see them. Six comps within a quarter mile of this home sold in the last year. 24,000, 25,000, 25,000, 32, 38, 54, 5. So if you're all into this thing at 60K, you already know you're going into the investment underwater and it's nothing but an uphill battle. So my opinion, I think you guys would be better served to pass on the investment. I don't think it makes sense for you. Everybody else who's watching the show, before you buy in a market like Cleveland, you need to do your due diligence like AHS Consulting has. For a few hundred bucks, as you can see, I can save you guys thousands and thousands of dollars. So if you want to work with me in the same way, send an email, sales at holtonwise.com. Give us your phone number. Let us know. Uh, about you when we give you a call. We want to know what makes you tick, what you're trying to accomplish, and we'll explain to you the best and most efficient way to do that. AHS, you guys wanted me to look over four properties. As I said, this is the second one I've done for you today. I'm about to look at your third one now. Thanks for watching. Subscribe to Holton Wise TV for more financial information, education, and entertainment.